Installation charge, 36-month monitoring agreement at $35.99 per month. Call for terms and conditions to this offer and protect your home license numbers. Call now, 1-866-669-8954. That's 1-866-669-8954. Welcome back, everybody. It's the PM Show with the legend of stage, screen, film, television, and now radio, Mr. Robert Conrad. And uh, we're taking your calls today, guys, 800-336-2225. It is a star-studded show, and guess who the star is? You guys out there in the listening audience. We want you to join in. Give us a call, 800-336-2225. And tell them about the email, because without the emails, there isn't a show. I tell you that every week. And uh, let me just say this. Thank you, thank you, thank you. There were more emails this week than in the history of the three years the show's been on the air. So thank you for, for that. And uh, if you want, you can uh, email us by... Yeah, send us to rconrad at crni.net. That's rconrad at crni.net. And if you can't spell Conrad, you're not a real Conrad fan. C-O-N? C-R-N. R-D. Oh. <laughs> no, no, C-O-N-R-A-D. And, and gotcha. A, Conrad Robert Norton Falk, F-A-L-K. Oh, gosh. All right, let's talk to Brian in Nashville. Nashville. Brian. Brian. Hello, guys. How are y'all? Good. Hey, What's buddy. going on, brother? I'm glad to see both of y'all. I'm finally back on where I can watch you all. Thank and you. Eric, I like the new hairstyle, buddy. Thank you, Brian. I'm growing my ears out. Yeah, don't you like Thanks. the facial thing that he's done? There's no, uh, what do you call it, wrinkles? Yeah, I did, yeah, got rid of the, did the whole Botox. That's all. <laughs> no, I didn't, do, I didn't do any of that. You didn't do hey, any he, Botox. He's young. He doesn't know what a wrinkle is. <laughs> uh, all right, I can tell him. All right, what's hey, up, uh, brother? Uncle Bob, uh... I love that shirt you got on. What are you today? About an eight five? I'm an eight eight eight. I'm a flat eight. Flat eight. Well, because well, yeah, we'll, we'll one of the employees there. here at the at the station, yes. uh, she was mean to me. So oh boy! I could have been an eight five, but oh boy. one of the she, here we go. She was mean. But anyway, go ahead. Just let it throw off like water on a duck's back. You'll be all right. <laughs> you know what doesn't? Have, hey, what doesn't destroy me makes me stronger. Right, right. You know who said are, that? Are you a college football fan, Uncle Bob? College football. Uh, you know, honestly, I am a high school football fan. Oh. And I want you to know that Montclair is a high school here in uh, uh, California, yes. uh, out here in the San Fernando Valley. And uh, they had a coach uh, back in the day. And uh, he coached an undefeated season of high school football. And what was his name, Eric? A coach out here who coached an undefeated season of high school football. At, and it was the, the name of the school was Montclair. And the last uh, team they played was uh, San Fernando. And you know what a great team San oh, Fernando is. Oh, yeah, they're, they're always killer had. football team, yeah. All right, so Brian, I just thought I'd share that with you. Uh, I'm a, a high school football fan. I used to be a college, but they, they, they recruit too much. When my son got nine offers to play, uh, football in his junior year, I thought there was something wrong with the program. Yeah, I kind of agree. They go overboard with that now. It's, yeah. it's gotten to be out of hand, really. Yeah, and yeah. I'm and disappointed in you, too. In me? Yeah. Why? Well, you didn't say who coached that football team. Oh, well, I'm sorry. I was listening. I was there we go. Intentively. Who did coach that football team? Here we go. Team? Was it you? You better believe it. <laughs> was it Bob Connor? Sure as hell was. Wow. Yep. I'm sorry, Uncle Bob. That's all right. And then I moved when the, my I only had two sons, and when they grew up, uh, I moved to soccer because that's what the girls were playing. They weren't playing football. Oh, okay. you followed the girls. Yes, yeah. and my daughter uh, Chelsea, the singer, skier, she uh, won the four county soccer championship. Oh, no kidding. Yeah, well, and well, her Uncle coach Bob, you was. Got your coffee with you? Well, yeah, I got it in my hand, and her coach well, was. Do you right now? All right, Tuss. Anyway, her Here's coach was her. Bob. Her coach go. was her sister. Oh, okay. So you have a, a heritage here in your family, Bob, of uh, professional coaching. Here, you guys are really great coaches. Yeah, but I mean, we've got so many emails. Let's get off. Let's that. do it. What, okay, let's what, do it. What's well, up, Ryan? We got to go. I, I know you got to go. Now, who would be if you had to pick a college football team? You're from Chicago. How about Northwestern? Oh uh, yeah, well Northwestern, yeah, but they didn't recruit as much as I would have wanted them to. I've got I've got a little scenario. I, yeah. I do a little play by play in my mind. Yeah. And if you got the ball, uh, they're going to hand the ball off to you. Okay, you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, here we go. 
yeah. with the ball. This is Conrad at the 35, to the 30, to the 25, 20, 15, 10. Touchdown, Uncle Bob Conrad for Northwestern. I love that. The crowd goes wild. I, I love that. Oh, but <laughs> Hey, but Brian, you got it wrong because you know when that happened. That happened in uh, high school because I know a guy who set the high school Hall of Fame for a running, a running back. Yes. At the high school level. Uh, what was his name? Robert Conrad. There you go. All right, Brian. Yeah, I'll see you Thanks, next week. Thank you. Thanks for the phone Thanks, call. Brian. All right. See, I love Brian. We and we send him these little messages. He's a fun guy. Well, man. we send him the messages and say, please ask this question. He picks it right up. And he picks it right yeah, up. Absolutely. And you know we are teasing. That doesn't really happen. Uh, but we had to tease you. Now, here is a real mistake. Uh-oh. This woman here um, says, uh, uh, but to be honest with you, uh, she says, I think you're... Uh, 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 pays me a compliment. And then she says, I can see why... This woman, she mentions her, fell for you. Uh-oh. We got to find out about this, Bob. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> it's getting hot.